to give you kind of an update on Jill. I know the last video I did was about, I think about Lars or one of the other vehicles that I have. But, um, and I mentioned it there, but just wanted to mention it here because this is gonna be all about Jill. Um, Jill is that 82 air-cooled Vanagon, California emissions, and Jill passed the emissions test this last week. Uh, it did have to do with um, the, the early failures of it, had to do with the EVAP system uh, within the gas, the fuel system, um, just too much too much air release and I found those with those two seals on top of the um, canisters that are underneath the fender here and uh, replaced those and, and everything went fine. Um, came back really under the numbers and, and that's pretty normal I think um, just because uh, they, they made these things really fuel efficient. So I'm going to sign off here for a little bit. Got some exciting news for you about Jill in just a few moments. original miles on Jill um, pretty exciting uh, if you don't know the story behind Jill I picked up Jill about eh, it's probably been five years maybe four and a half years ago um, first car after the fire um, if you don't know that you maybe need to go back a little further to see you know what what fires I'm talking about but um, we had a big fire that came through our neighborhood and wiped out everything my old VW um, bus Nelly Anyway, there's a, there's a story about that back in the back in YouTube. Um, but yeah, so I've I've had Jill for about four and a half years, I think, maybe five, and uh, picked her up in Oregon. Um, didn't really, I mean, you know, ran well. I had to do some stuff to the fuel tank and um, all the hoses, redo all that stuff. But um, being air cooled. And a California emissions, uh, past smog first time, uh, past smog several times, and just just this last time I had a little bit of trouble with the smog, but just had to replace a couple of seals. Um, didn't find out till about a year ago or eight months ago that it has a uh, an older transaxle than it should have. So knowing that, I could assume that maybe the engine is not original, so the engine may not have 100,000 miles, but I know back at 80,000 miles or so, I did a whole kind of top end hoses and spark plugs and um, injectors, that kind of stuff at the top end of the engine, but didn't really, I've never really dug in below and I've only done um, valve adjustments. I did do um, push rod tube seals, I redid those. and. But everything else is pretty original on, on Jill, and so pretty happy with um, her as a daily driver, pretty much on the weekends, but um, able to drive just fine whenever needed. And uh, happy to say that she's now at 103,000 miles, 100,003,000 wow. miles, Jill the VW Vanagon. Thanks for joining me, Mr. Smith's Garage, and uh, we'll talk to you soon.